Let's dig a little deeper into FTX, shall we? So breaking report, 515 million stolen from collapsed crypto exchange FTX in a matter of hours. New CEO locks down remaining funds in secure storage. So let's recap. The Biden administration takes our tax dollars and sends it to Zelensky in Ukraine for humanitarian aid, right? Then Ukraine uses this money in aid to partner with FTX, which filed for bankruptcy yesterday. And FTX donates it to the Democratic Party. This guy is the second biggest donor on the Democratic Party. Under who? Judge George Soros is the number one donor. This one is the second highest donor. So then what happens? Comes all the way back around full circle and backs the Biden. So Sam Bankman, Freed or Fried, I'm not sure, is the son of Barbara Fried. Who is Barbara Fried? She is the co-founder of the political party fundraising organization called Mind the Gap and and Get Out and Vote organization, including the Center for Voter Information and also responsible for launching FTX Crypto Exchange. Now, the exchange of FTX was an overnight success. This enabled Sam here, her son, to become the second biggest mega donor for the Democratic Party. Doesn't that really make you think? Now, this become the biggest donor for Biden run for election for his party. Now, on election day, FTX implodes in completely. If you think this scandal is done, no, it goes much deeper. Gabe Bankman, the brother of Sam, is also a former Jane Street trader, is founder of Guarding Against Pandemics. He actually was a legislative correspondent for the House of Representatives. Also an advisor for large political donors for the Democratic Party. In Atlanta is a WEF member on the Global Council agenda. Now the father, Joseph, is a Stanford professor, lobbied for hedge fund professors, circuit managers for Congress before. No records exist. Next, head of ventures, commercial FTX, Amy Wu. And this started with the Clinton Foundation years ago. The Shad C, FTX. Director of Engineering has spent more than $8 million on Democratic candidates. And finally, Obama's Commodity Futures Trading Commission, which is literally the head of the X policy and regulation. The organization wants to spend over a billion dollars on the 2024 elections. So money laundering operation has just been busted open. Country crazy out.